Oh my god, yes. It is finally here. You know what time it is. I think you know what time it is. You'd be better know what time it is. Alright, so let's read the description, shall we? Lumia Legacy is live. The adventure so far leads you to the first battle theater challenge. Okay, so the first gym battle. Battle theater challenge is pretty much the gym battle. Let us know if you come across any bugs, and we will do our best to fix them. We will have more updates rolled out soon, starting with trading and PvP. The game currently runs on an autosave feature, okay. There will additionally be features added to, imp to help improve soft resetting certain encounters. Okay, cool, like in Brick Browns. Not all battle mechanics are 100% final, and you may see a few tweaks now and then for balancing purposes. Alright. Good. Uh, I'm I'm happy. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm playing this. Let me go to games real quick. It'll like pop up right there. See? Almost everybody is playing this game. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. I have to make it full screen. Um, is this working? Oh yes it is. Oh yes it is. Oh my god. I haven't even prepared myself. Here it is. Lumion Legacy. Veils of Shadow. I am happy. So we got continue, which yeah. RTD, which is like the trade reserves and stuff. Adventures, which is so this one is just the Veils of Shadow adventure, yes, obviously. And then we got the new game and the credits. So let's check out the credits. Oh my God! Shout out to all of these people. T. Brad M. I butchered his name last time. Lando sixty four thousand. Shipool. Santos Verdon. Uh, Orchestra Cats, Onigiri Tsuki, uh, Zombie Hours, Roselius, Our Hero, Robal One, uh, Bobbin Katzen, The Coterium, B <laughs> BS Lick Music, B Slick Music, not BS Lick Music, <laughs> Pwenny, um, Bree B, uh, and yeah, neat. I am so hyped, oh my god, I am so hyped. Right, people are. The chat just opened up. Oh my god, mid is town. Looks awesome. Lumion Laboratory of Rory. The music's still the same. Alright, so we've seen these parts through the YouTuber demo. Oh my god! That's like the Dedene Pokemon! Lumion. Thingy. Alright, so here's our dad. Obviously, we know him. The YouTuber demos. Oh my god, here they go. Oh shoot. Oh, fascinating. Wait, I haven't changed my character thro to our throw. Oh my god. This just ends. A storm has appeared out of nowhere in southern uh, southeast Roria. Meteorologi meteorologists are stumped by this anomaly in the weather that appeared so suddenly. As we continue to investigate, we will keep you informed. As always, tune into Rorian News on 6 to stay up to date on everything happening. Right, so I don't know what it said at the bottom, but in the YouTuber demo it said like uh, Lumion Legacy is still not out, but I guess it said... Uh, I just got a glimpse of it. I think it said, um, I think it said Lumion Legacy is out. Uh, Lumion Watch is now 12% cheaper or something like that. Hey, honey, could you please come downstairs? That's our mom, obviously. Alright, so the things, the tabs are supposed to be up there. Uh, so, but they're not there. I guess since we talked to mom and then after that. Oh, there you are. Your father called a moment ago. He was at the dig site when the storm came. He said something very interesting that ha has happened to the stone tablet he's been studying. He insists on showing you. Insists. I can't read. Oh, I see you tried on your new Lumi watch. To set it up, you have to press this button. Yeah, just over there. You just magically boop pressed it. But here it is. Welcome. Please enter your name. Of course, my name is Alan. Yes, Alan. That's that's good. Alan. Uh -huh. I need to say it like that. Alan, not Alan. 
I need to remember that. I'll teach you more about your new Lumi watch later. For now, I need to get going. I need to take back to the Lumias that we were carrying for the... Yeah, the they aren't trained yet, and they startle easily. Don't forget, your father wanted to go out, uh, wanted you to go see him at the big site. Be careful in the weather out there. Alright, I can't read. I'm legally blind. So, we got the map, items, ID, Lumi boosts, and options. Let's go to the map. Let's see what the map looks like. Apparently, there is no map. Okay, let's go to the items. Oh my god. Look at that transition! It's like a 3D bag! Got medicine, MMs, fruit, key item, and discs. Discs are the Pokeballs in this game, pretty much. Now we have the ID. It's cool about the ID thing. Like, you see here, in the items, there's a bag and then it just fades away. But in the ID, the ID shows up and opens up, which is cool. Training points. Eh, yeah, whatever. Pretty much the old uh, kind of Game Pass stuff. Also, you can run now. Which is cool. My friend played this. Like, the game has been out for an hour now. So, yeah. Oh my god. This looks so cool. Alright, where is where's Gastroke? I want to see Gastroke. Gastroke? I saw Think Noodles coming over here. Oh, here he is. I definitely should have put my character on Arthur. Can I reset my character? I can. Dude, I'm about to put my character on Arthur. Gastrook is loving this rain. Oh my god. That's Gastrook right there, fellas. Oh my god. When you walk on like this, the footsteps change. Dang, I forgot about it. Midis Dick Sight. Alright, so this is kind of its own separate location now. Alright, so last time in Pokemon Brick Bronze, there's these lights and our parents were just standing here. But now this place is opened up. Oh, there you are, Alwen. I see you got my message from your mother. You'll never believe what just happened. First, we have outside when the first we were outside when the storm clouds appeared out of nowhere. Rain came pouring down suddenly, so we ran in here to seek shelter. That's when the text on the tablet unexpectedly began to glow. The characters actually came off and completely rearranged themselves. I know it sounds crazy, but you will find that text does not match what we previously recorded. What's happening now? Oh shoot. Dude, the animations are so I can't believe it. The tablet is actually gone. All that research just got up and flew away. I don't know what accent to give him. No, old man. This isn't good. We weren't able to finish transcribing the next text. The pieces of the stone tablets seem to have all gone off in different locations. Directions. I just guessed a word. I think somewhere, or someone, or something didn't want us reading that message. We're going to have to search for all of the pieces so that we can continue to study the stone. That's odd. The rain seems to be to have stopped. Alan. Alan. I'm going to... <laughs> I'm just going to call myself Alan. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to the Lumia Laboratory to update your mother on all of this. You should meet us there when you get a chance. See you later. See you later, for alligator. This is so cool. Right. First, I'm going to go to that one house that I said had, a, like, the thing is... The, the 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 is this the house? I think this is the house. All right. So when you come here and talk to this kid, these battle theater shows are amazing. Naya is so cool, and her Gekko is really tough. I hope I'll be uh, able to go and watch her battle one day, dude. Me too. Actually, I'm gonna battle her. All right. So the first gym leader is probably gonna be Naya. All right. So you guys saw Gekko. Yes. Alright, now, the thing I want to do now is actually change my Roblox character to, like, Arthro. Yeah, I just spent nine minutes looking for some Arthro stuff, but, like, I didn't find any. So, alright, here we go in. Hey, Alan. Uh, I'm glad to see what <laughs> that you made it back safely, sweetie. Oh, wait, it was... 
Hey champ, good timing. I was just catching your mother up on what happened at the dick site. So, for months you have been su studying that mysterious stone to town and edit it is that fact that we have around the same time that the mysterious storm appeared over the town. That can't be a coincidence. I believe you are right. Soon after the text change on the stone, it was broken and the pieces were scattered in the wind. I didn't even get enough time to transcribe the new message on the ta tablet before the pieces disappeared. You told me that you had the de de deciphered? De oh, deciphered. <laughs> I can't read. Deciphered the original text a week ago. Uh, what did the original message say again? It roughly translated to, The creature's secret lies dormant within until the day of awakening it comes again. Hoopa! It's Hoopa! If I could only get the pieces of the tablet back, I could deci decipher its new message. Hopefully, whatever it said it would give us some clue. Didn't you have a camera with you? You could have just taken a picture of it or your phone, your Lumi watch, your Apple watch. Did you happen to see where they went? No, they flew out in different directions. There is no telling where they could have gone. Didn't you tell me that the tablet emanated a sub subtle but unique energy signature? Yes, and it interfered with our equipment while we were digging nearby. This is what led us in to it in the first place. What if you fine-tuned that technology to, de to detect the missing pieces of the tablet? Hmm. Yes. Yes, that just might work. If I had I access to a satellite array, I could emit a single strong and wide enough to detect the pieces. But who do I know that has a facility equipped with a satellite array? You want to use my equipment? Is that okay with you, dear? Of course! I mean, <laughs> you want to use my equipment? Yeah. Oh my god, that's so sweet! <laughs> of course I'm interested to see if this is tied to a Lumion I've yet to do document. Excellent, thank you. I do wonder though, how will you be able to uh, operate your machine here while searching for the missing pieces at the same time? That is a good question. Oh, look at me! My field research days are coming to a close. I'm getting close. I'm getting too old to get on adventures looking for spooky rocks. Maybe if I was still in my prime. <laughs> no worries, Derek. I actually had someone else in mind. Sweetheart, how do you feel about letting Alan in my place to, uh, for research for the stones? I think that would be perfect. I've been thinking about trusting Alan with Lumion from the lab for quite some time now. I would love nothing more than to see our child on an adventure. Lumians by their side, experiencing what I did when I was young. Ah yes, the life of a Lumian trainer. Will you help me out? Your mother is offering to give you your very first Lumian to help you along the way. I say Alan has been wanting something like this for a while. I'm certainly not surprised for one bit considering uh, how much Alan watches battle theater shows on TV. I do? I don't even watch TV. That's perfect, champ. Maybe one day you'll be on TV when you challenge it battle theater yourself. Well then, it's settled. I need to uh, I need to get set up in here. Sweetheart, why don't we give Alan a Lumion now and then practice with a quick battle? That's a great idea. Alan, follow me over here and let's find you a Lumion you like. Oh my god, finally. This is so exciting. Being your first Lumion is so special. Lumions are lifelong companions that you will never forget. Pick the one that you like the most and when you've decided, I'll teach you how to battle. Attention everybody. Oh my god, they even turn around. You all remember Alan, don't you? Gather around. Don't be shy. Alright, Feevine is missing. Let's see. Who is missing? Feevine. Storing energy. Nice detail. Come here, Feevine. Okay, Alan. Pick any Lumion you like. Alright, so. Let's see. Snow Cub. Not really a nice type. Uh. Fan. Embit fire. It's a little bit boring now. Eaglet. Meh. Don't like the eagle. So I an eagle and dog design kind of thing. Dripple. Just wet Charmander. Weevolt. Eh, kind of bored of, of all the electric types too. But it looks cute though. Uh, Vambat. 
looking kind of cool. Dark type isn't really my thing, but pretty cool for a dark type. And Fever was plant type. Not really a massive plant type. But I really like Trico though. And this kind of gives me like Trico but though I don't know, I'm kind of stuck between these two. I would yeah. oh, it. You know what? No, I can't. I don't know. I can't decide. You know what? Screw it. We're going with Bad. I like I like to experience new things. Would you like to nickname your fan bat? Not really. I, I really like to keep their original names. Now before we battle, I want to explain a few things. Loonians are companions to other trainers. In a battle, you and your Pokemon group together and strategize together. Now without further delay, let's see what you can do. Alright, before we begin, I want to explain a few things about battling. You'll notice on your Loonie watch that your Loonian's health is displayed in green energy in purple okay uh, so I learned this that the things uh, the moves is not like PP it uses energy instead of like having enough energy for this move this move you use it too much you can't use it anymore but this you can use all your moves but if the energy meter runs out you can't use it anymore any of them. So that's why there's the rest and weight option. Displayed in green and a synergy in purple where Lumion's health reaches zero, it'll be unable to battle and you'll need to use another Lumion if you have any. Uh, you'll notice if you have four options, fight, items, Lumions, and run. Go ahead and select your fight option. Now, if you look at your Lumion's move, you'll notice a number next to EC. This moves energy costs. Okay, so basically, if I use this, it's gonna use like 15 of my energy. Right. Uh, so I can see this, which I think it does a super effective. Kabunga used grace. What type is Kabunga though? Oh my! It's dead. Mom, you're done. All right, so we got Nah. Bite the target with a small amount of force. Declare your uh, hostility toward your opponents with an energy growl, lowering their attacks. Yeah. Uh, bite the opponent with sharp fangs, they also make them flinch. Alright, so pretty much. Let's use Maw. Oof! It's dead. Level 6. That was an excellent battle. I think you and your Lumion will do just fine as you go on your adventure together. I've got my gear all set up now. Come, have a look. Alright. That's good, Pa. This machine will take the signals received from the stone chunks and display on screen a general location of where they are. And what do you look at that? It's already detecting a signal from Gale Forest. That isn't far from here, it's just past Cheshma Town. Oh my god, Cheshma Town. Well then, Cheshma Town is one town over from us. It's just on the other side of Route 1. You should have no trouble getting there. Alan, I needed to travel to Gale Forest and see if you can find the first missing tablet piece. Then report back. Your mother and I will communicate with you over your Lumi Watch. The Lumi Watch is a powerful piece of technology that is capable of doing many things. If you find anything, give us a call and we'll decide what to do from there. That sounds excellent. Oh, and take this. Mom gave you a closet key. The closet key was stored in the item lab. This is a key to the door at the back in the lab. Behind the door you'll find a closet containing a few items I think you will find useful for the row. I'd like to add that if you are interested in bringing any more of the lab's Lumians with you on your way adventures, you can come talk to me. Okay, that was Derek. Alright now, Alan, I think you are all set to go. Your father and I are here for you when you need us. Good luck, Alan, and let us know if you need anything. Hey, John, good luck out there. Alright, direction. Yeah, 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 sure. Um, alright, so, I know this is an LC. Expand storage, uh, alright, 8, 8. So, 8. Oh, so I can do this. Hmm. Bad Bad doesn't know what to think of you. I don't know. 
All right, so instead of Pokeballs now, these are there are these crates. Just kick them. Five small meds. The small meds were stored in the items up. Dude, the the hitting sound is just so far fetched, dude. All right, so dude, like look, these are the jog and this is the run. All right, so there's no guy blocking our path. That is good. Is there no team eclipse? What do you think, Bam Bam? All right, Bam Bam doesn't know what to think about. Um, yeah. Bzz, bzz. All right, I think I'm gonna go to the end, to Cheshma Town, and then end the video. Bzz, bzz. Someone is calling you on your Lumi watch. Oh my God, it's Mom. Wait. Oh my God, I can tilt the camera. That's so cool. Hey, Alan, it's Mom. Before you run out onto Route One, I want to quickly explain something. If you use the key I gave you to open the closet in the lab and look what is inside the boxes, then you should have some capture discs. While adventuring, you will run into many interesting wild lumians. They pop out as you run through the tall grass outside. You can add these wild lumians to your team to help you battle, but to do that, you will need to use the capture discs. First, you simply weaken any lumian that you wish to capture. Then, you take capture discs. Uh, you take a capture disc from your items app and throw it at the Lumion. Be careful not to knock it out while weakening it, though. Anyway, that's all I wanted to share. Take care of yourself, sweetie. Talk to you later. Alright, all right, so I think that's the way, like, there isn't MM over there. Alright, let's check out Lumion's. Also, I can bench them, which is, like, pretty much... You can use five Lumion's, but there are two more slots, so you can switch them. But, like... You can't use them in battle, I think. I think that's how they work. They probably like this is like a having a bot, an LC box with you. You can switch out your lumions out before battling. You can't switch them in battle. I think. Right one. Well, I. Oh my God! This is the this is the Dedenne Pokemon, Lumion. All right. I don't wanna. Um. I don't wanna kill it. So let's use Naw. Dude, that animation looks sick. He is not a <laughs> wimp. But he got one HP. Stupid. Alright, we're good. Doddle? Or a Mass Defense Bill? Doddle? What kind of move? It's my word. Okay. Let's use this. That's a great name, actually. The last day I've been out to fuck with that Lumi video. Your nickname to Twilight. You call them a game kind of experience. Nice. Alright, let's read about him, shall we? Lumipedia. Check this out. Wait. Wait. Oh, no. It only goes to 107? What? It's still Kambunga. What type is he? Can I know? Typeless. What type are you? <laughs> Please, are you ghost type? What are you? A dark was super effective on you, so I guess. Um. All right, he's typeless. I know it. Mouse Lumion. Well, what are you? Bat Lumion. <laughs> what are you? Beep Lumion. <laughs> it should have been hashtags, dude. Often found hopping through fields. They use their powerful legs to escape predators. So, there isn't that guy blocking us, so we can continue. This guy fell asleep. You know what? I wanna I wanna bring out Twilight. Oh, he's smaller than usual. He's not the smallest he can be, but he is still pretty small. Alright, I'm gonna pull this guy out. Oh my god! He like hops around, dude! Right, whatever, I'm just gonna talk to you. What? I was about to pass out, dude! Um, what do I do? What do I do? Is there a way I can help this guy out? I don't want to use all my meds. Alright, so, um, I said that I would reach the end and then end the episode, but, like, my Lumians are about to die, and I, I don't think we have enough time. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please hit that like button. That will be amazing. Uh, also, if, uh, also that lets me know how much you want to see the next video. And hit that subscribe button. It helped me out a ton. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time in a few days. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Goodbye.
game is awesome.